Hi guys, so there's been a lot of changes the last time I saw you. One, I haven't been posting in a while, and it's because my phone that I normally film on has been really weird, like my storage has been all over the place, and I won't be able to feel videos or even take pictures on Snapchat and like that, so I've had problems with that. And now I finally sorted it out, and I've got my iPad working here, so I can upload on my iPad. But today, and also another change, I have cut my hair. It's short, but and also what we're doing today is I'm going to be unboxing this package that I've got today. It was meant to come on the 6th of August, and now it's the 5th, 5th of August, but we'll have a look. And I've already opened it up to see what to see if it definitely is mine, if they've mixed it up or something like that. And it is mine, and what I have got is makeup brushes. Now, I think I can scan because these are very similar to like the shapes. The, like the actual brushes, like the actual hair brushes are ones I wanted, but the ones that I ordered on eBay where they were longer and they were black, like that was part was black and that part was rose gold. So I think I've been scammed, but I still super soft brush all hairs. The first one I picked out is this one, and it's probably and they don't have no names at all, and they this one will probably be good for like or something like that or maybe just non-powder um if you've got a small face this probably would be good for powder um this is my non-powder brush that i have so and this one fits perfectly so it's up to you whichever one you would like the next one there's like a few it's like three face brushes and then one two three four five six seven maybe eight eyeshadow brushes now this one i don't really think will be good for it might be good for blusher or contour but i feel like contour is a lot better with my diagonal one this is my everyday contour brush and they're very different similar sizes and then this is my blusher brush so maybe it might be good for like sweeping off the bake and your eyes or just something like that and the next one because i've actually got millions of foundation brushes i think that um, i might use this for face masks i got a really nice lush one that i've been using lately and because i've had like my nails done quite a few times over the last couple of months i um, i can't really do it because obviously so a brush is my next best option and i don't want to ruin any of those burns so i think this would be good for the face mask and um, plus it's a lot more like um stiff than the other ones Okay, now here are all the eyeshadow brushes. Now, I'm just gonna pick random ones out. There's a few of them like the same, or like smaller versions of the same, so. This is this brush. I actually don't have a brush like this. I think this would be really, really good for like, um, doing cut creases and putting the concealer on, because it's flat. Oh, what else would be good for? Under the eyes, so. Now the next, well, the next two are, I think, of the same or very, very, very similar. I think that the same, but that one's more, like, rounded and that one's more pointy. But they're, in my eyes, they're exactly the same. They're just a flat top brush, which are good for, like, pack and eyeshadows, especially shimmer ones. And then I've got, basically, a smaller version of this brush. So, yeah, again, that would probably be... a better because it's got a lot more detail because it's a lot smaller. Now I've got this angle brush and um, compared to the one that I got, I've got it somewhere. Um, I've got one like this. It's not the one that I'm looking for but it is an angled eyeshadow brush. Um, but it's just like a lot longer hairs and it's a lot more um, stiff and sturdy again. So yeah again now i basically got a smaller version of um that angle brush if i can find it this one it's basically a much smaller version and i mean it tiny so uh, this would probably be good for like eyeliner because it's a lot smaller in size now when i first saw this i only saw this one first and i was like Wait, the frig! I've they proper scam me. It's like a it's like a pen that doesn't even work. But it's a lid to an eye, to a brush. Now this is basically a smaller version of this one. Now 
I when I looked at the brushes, I didn't realise they were big versions and smaller versions, so first time for me. But I don't know what's the point in this lid because it doesn't fit the bigger ones. It only fits this brush, I think. I, I haven't tried it with this one. Yeah, it only fits this one. And I don't know, but yeah, basically a smaller version of that. And then I got two brushes left, and here is the big version of this version. So a tiny little lip brush. I've actually got one very similar to this. If I can find it, I got this one, but this wasn't like how I bought it. This oh, I found it. That one was like actually a broken brush, but I kept it because it's really good for lip. But I've got these two. So a lot of these brushes I've already got, but it's good to have spares. I just wish they come like that in this packaging because I feel like rose gold and white or rose gold and black very sleek. Uh, but this one, this the big size, I actually haven't got. So, but anyway, that concludes this video. Um, I might be filming another video today because I put on my Instagram. Oh, do you know those like questions that you can put on Instagram? I've put one on there and I said ask me questions on my YouTube channel. And I will give you my Instagram account now. It's Nia underscore Franklin underscore 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 at the end. So There's two underscores. And Franklin is spelled F-R. Well, you can see on my account. But I'll put it in my description. My Snapchat name is... Have a look. I'm really confused with Snapchat and all that. I just go around telling my friends that my Snapchat name is completely different to what it is. But my Snapchat name is near underscore Franklin or just blackout near Franklin. I think it's near underscore Franklin. But yeah, or you can just take that. So there we go. I will see you in my next video. Bye.